Kabbalistic solutions for contemporary problems has come up with an innovation for people who have habits. You know, habits that would qualify for, say, Alcoholics Anonymous, AA. When one would have habits of liquor, say, or drug addiction. Or, in my opinion, um, tobacco. When I was a kid, a pack of cigarettes cost 25 cents. Now, they cost $20. A cigarette addiction, you know, I I had people in my family, I think my mother smoked three packs a day. Now, she gave it up because of health, but three packs a day now is $60 a day, you know? Forget about its deleterious effect on physical health and that it's a killer, The $60 a day I'm talking about. If a person takes takes a drug, well, let's go to liquor. Liquor itself, how much is a bottle? Whatever a bottle is. A person who is stuck having to buy liquor. And then how about whatever drugs are? $50, $100 a day? So what does this mean? It means that you're tied into the societal for that amount of money, for the amount of money that you have to make, earn, beg, steal, work for, to attain that amount of money. That amount of money means that you're part of the society. Money is a societal item. Money is the society. So how to give up society is how to give up, is when you can give up money. And then you're not obliged to work. Working, to me, is the killer. Working in a society, giving up time, time. Whenever I work, my whole day is ruined. Also, in most things, most physical things, they don't pay you for the time of travel to to the work. And again, as usual, I'm long-winded. And this new version of how and why, how... The reason to give up drug addiction is not for the drugs. It's for that you have to pay money for the drugs. And it's money is the tie into the society. Leave the society. That's a stage of life. So here's my view. I mean, this is the same thing of of after being a householder, After having your family, what do you do? You leave. It's the last stage of life. You go up the mountain like Moses. And on the mountaintop, he fasts for 40 days. He's left his wife behind, his children behind. He goes alone up the mountain. When he was in the mountain, when he lived up in the mountain, he didn't live in an apartment like I do.
lived on the mountaintop. He was away from the social. He was away from the group. And just like a nausea, it doesn't mean that you're doesn't mean that you don't understand the group or aren't part of the group, but the ultimate stage is being away from the group, away from the societal. It only proves the societal as a base. My apartment is a 10th floor tomb. A social obligation that I have to pay rent for. Tied into the societal by money. And so again, I'm long-winded. But there should be a program for the, the breaking of habits. Cigarettes, liquor, smoking. To make the people understand that when they lose these habits, they lose the tie to the societal. These habits look like anti-society, but they're really the ultimate tie to the society. Because there's an obligation to make a, 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 a certain amount of money each day to pay for those habits. That hundred dollars a day that has to be paid for the habits is the tie into the society. That's the negative aspect. Not the taking of these habits. Not the taking of the juice of the habits. So the person, the person who has a habit is, is the ultimate tie to the, is the ultimate societal. It's the ultimate purchaser. And this hasn't been done for people, how to, how to break these habits. They always tell you how to come back into the society. These, these things, all these programs are for how to embrace the society. I tell you that the breaking of these habits is the removal from the society. The habit is the society. So in a sense, that's what makes it negative. That's, that's what makes it limiting. Money is the curse. If something costs money, it's societal. Remove yourself from society. Remove yourself from money. That's why when, the, when one looks at, at, at how to receive manna from heaven, manna from heaven is without work. Manna from heaven is food or panasa, meaning livelihood. It just flows down into you. So I, I, I've read, I have to read them again, these AA things. Talk about a higher power. When, when you talk about social and stuff like higher power in a social sense, let's go up to the highest power, which removes you from the society. And if you can be removed from the society, you realize that you have been in that stage of the societal, of the social So this is a new way to do it. Not to bring the person back. Not, not to bring the person back, 
but to remove the person. They have been in the societal crutches more than anybody else. In their desire to get away from the societal, they've become more into the society than anybody else. In their desire for heightened experiences uh, and drinking in the word spirits and, and in, 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 in drug taking, because they can't take the society, they, they, they want more. They become, they become more tied in. And I think that if this is explained to people, that's the way to break the habits. Not to tell them to come back, but to tell them to leave. Society is the limitation. Society is the limitation to the drug habit. And what you have to do to, to get that, to get the drugs. There are different stages in life for everybody. In the Talmud and in, in all things. There's a duality of right and wrong, and then there's a, a Torah of Etzilut that's only right. Inside, there's a kernel of perfection within everybody. That kernel has been blocked, stamped on crushed and that's how we make the olive oil we take an olive and we crush it so the most pure olive oil and remember it has to be pure inside that olive is pure inside pure thoughts and how do we get that how do we get the oil out of that pure oil? We crush it. Oh, come back into society. How wonderful society is. Well, I don't see it. Group consciousness. The whole idea is to get the Yehida level. And what is the Yehida level? Yahida is the number 37. Yahida is the number 37. That's the Yehida aspect of the soul. And that 37 is the is the second surrounding light. And that second surrounding light is actually a square. And that square is the Yehida. And that surrounds and that's, that's the physical. The four corners of the physical. That don't touch the circle inside. Which is the higher level. The surrounding light. These auras. And that sur second surrounding light of the Yehida is a letter Mem. Mem. Mem, final mem, that's 640. 
And then you have that as the, as the final mem surrounding around. And then you have, then you have a samech, samech mem final kaf, 600. And you add, that's the higher level. And when you add the two, you have 1,240. 640 and 600, 1,240. And then that's, what is that? That's two times 620. That's two times keta. And the saying, there's room on the head for two crowns. And what is the second crown? The second crown, that mem is malchus, that goes on top. And this is Keter Malkus. And this is when the feminine crowns the masculine. And that's how you know that this, what I'm telling you, is right. The ultimate thing is when the feminine crowns the masculine. And that's what I've received. Those are the two squares. The feminine crowns the masculine. So the circle, which is the snake... And then the square is the Mashiach. Keter Malkus. Keter Malkus, which is 1,116. Or Shimon. It's brought to you here. Keter Malkus. It's the crowning of the head. By the feminine is brought to me to receive, and this is the tw- this is why I'm saying all this. To receive the concept of how to break habits. To, to, if a person realizes that the, when they break the habit, they're removed from the social, they're not coming back to the social. They're removed. They're going to the higher level of, of their desire for the, for, the, for the habit. To give up $60 a day for cigarettes, for three packs of cigarettes. It's not what it does to your body. It does... It's what it does to your social. And once you realize you remove yourself from the social, the habit is broken. The desire is changed. The person is coming to a higher level, not removed back, you know, back into, into lower levels. That's why they wanted to get to the spiritual level of spirits and, and to be high, not low. They want to be high. Well, this is, makes them higher. This takes them to the mountaintop. So this is my new way. See, it's the negative of, the, of AA. Everything AA says is wrong. Wrong. Just like my power of negative thinking. Take everything the societal wants and reverse it. People are screaming to be removed, not to be within. It's a high state of consciousness. But the ultimate societal is to make the profit look off a pack of cigarettes. The pack of cigarettes costs nothing. And who's making the money off of the cigarettes? The state. It's the same thing with the lotto. They now own gambling. And what is gambling? It's the it's bringing back into the society. You have to gamble on items within the society. Horse races. Get that. Get out. 
Get the hell out. Now I've only said the outside here, and not the detail. And like everything else, and in my, if you listen to the last 10 seconds and you heard the whole video, everything's a preparation. This, the, the way to break the habit is to realize that it's costing you money. And money is the habit. Money is the ultimate social control. Give up money. 